Well, I'd been in America for weeks, and all, all I'd been reading was that were American scripts for films and TV. And then I got sent these scripts from home, and I suddenly read it, and you know, it's full of like chaos, <laughs> and magic, and invention, and uh, and I, I immediately just thought, I thought, I've got to, if I, I'd love to play this. This is craziness, and uh, it's a chance to just. To, to clown about, to have a chance to goof around, and um, but it's and, and it, I just fell in love with it. It's so charming and sweet. Moist von Lipwig. Hmm. That's quite a name. Were your parents stupid or just plain cruel? Yeah, it's a great name. It's just I, I liked it because it was so weird and different and immediately appealed to me. It's the kind of thing that probably if I'd have been born in Discord, I would have been called something like Moist von Lipwig, probably. There's been a bunch of the Terry Pratchett people on set as extras the last two days, and um, they've been amazing because they're right up for it. And they, because they know all the situations and the circumstances, they're, they're right into, you know, we're coming in on the coach and they're screaming and cheering. They're responding as they would. The Terry Pratchett fans that I've met, they do really talk about them as if they're real people. It's like, you know, as if it's somebody they just saw last week. and. You know, and the way that, uh, you know, I, I, one, of them, one of the Terry Pratchett fans went up to Charlie Dance yesterday and said, um, uh, um, w w there were a few raised eyebrows when you were cast as Lord Vetinari because obviously he's meant to be dark haired. He is dark haired. And, and, he, and Charlie was like, oh, all right. And, uh, and the guy said, but as soon as you stepped out of the carriage, we knew it was all going to be fine. Adora Bell Dearheart. I've never seen Black look so adorable. If you say adorable, I'll be forced to shoot you after all. There's a phrase in the book that says he'd met other women before, but they were, uh, they were, they were foothills compared to the icy heights of Mount Deerheart, and that's, that's exactly right, and it's been like that. And it makes it more fun to play because um, I, it's, it's like I have to keep trying different angles to get anywhere, and I just don't get anywhere, which is brilliant. Miss Deerheart, I don't suppose... You'd like to have dinner tonight? With you? Hmm. No. I've got things to do, but thanks for asking. What makes it more fun, I think, is that uh, it, it's, it's harder work for Moist. But, you know, I know she likes me in the thing, so that's what keeps me going. I really am making progress. Perhaps. The cast is amazing, I have to say. It's just been a real honour to work with some amazing actors. Welcome to government service. You get people like Charlie Dance, David Suchet, Timothy West, Andrew Sachs coming in, and, and it's like they're really, they're like legends to me, these people, and they come in and they're so supportive and they're getting behind me and they're going, go on, you're doing well, and I'm like, uh, oh, stop it. But no, it's been, it's been a, real, uh, a real privilege to work with these people. They're, they're brilliant. Pump 19. I stood at the bottom of a hole a hundred feet deep and pumped water to the city for two centuries. But now I walk in the sunlight, feel the wind on my face. This is better. It's, it's quite an important relationship between Moist and Mr. Pomp. There's a real poignancy about Mr. Pomp that I never saw just reading it. There's a real... It's quite sad and it's... Um, it's been really interesting having that factored in as well. What are you doing? Rescuing you. Your safety is my concern. Oh, hell, last time you said that? I just would like it to be, um, like a big, like a big bundle of joy. I think it should be magical and, and uplifting, ultimately. It's very life-affirming, and I think it's something you should leave think, feeling very happy after having watched it. You are still the best postmaster we've ever had. Good luck, boys. <laughs>